The Suns falling to the Biscuits tonight. Andy, uh, after the top of the or before the top of the fourth inning, Rafael for call lifted. Uh, anything you can tell us on his status and how Rafael's feeling? Uh, I think he's feeling okay. He had a little tightness in his groin, uh, running the bases there. Uh, you know, I don't think he pulled anything. You know, just with him being so close to coming back uh, as a precautionary measure with him from the game. And really, after that moment, it kind of seemed like that was a deflating moment for the Suns offensively, really unable to get anything going the rest of the ball game. Yeah, we were rolling early. Uh, he, he did a great job tonight. He had a couple hits. was really our, uh, our table starter and uh, table setter, so to speak. And uh, we swung the bats good early, and we just couldn't figure out their start of the rest of the game. Andrew Heaney really sharp through the first three and then kind of ran into a little bit of trouble in the top of the fourth as really their bats started to heat up. Yeah, he was uh, feeling under the weather tonight, really couldn't catch his breath, had a little respiratory in infection and uh, uh, labored a little bit and just kind of ran out of gas there and they got to him. The Suns will be back at it tomorrow night with Angel Sanchez taking the mound. What's the key to getting you guys back on track and getting a W tomorrow? Well, they got a good team over there and uh, they're really exposing any mistakes that we make. So we got we to play a lot better, we got to uh, we got to pitch better, we got to swing the bats better, run the bases, everything. So they got a good club and uh, we're making some mistakes, they're taking advantage of it. Andy, we appreciate your time. We'll catch up with you tomorrow for Game 3. Sounds good. Thank you.